Okay. Okay, so, so for a Pratt tie, you want to start off with the reverse side facing forward. Okay, with the Windsor tie, normally it's with the reverse side facing your body, but we're doing it this way. And with the Pratt, like I said, you uh, don't need as much length, so the shorter end can be a lot shorter than the long end, unlike a Windsor again, which helps with gentlemen like myself with uh, a larger torso. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the shorter end and I'm going to put it over the longer end. And I'm just going to use my finger and my thumb here just to hold the, the pieces together. I'm going to take the long end, I'm going to feed it down through the hole, tighten it up a little bit, again using my finger to brace it. We are then throwing it over the front in the hole created by the uh, space between my arm and my chest. Four finger to hold again. Long end is being fed up through the opening next to my body and my neck. Okay. And then we're going to try to feed this through the opening that's been created right here. There we go. Now I'm going to just play around with this to make sure that I've got the back end covered nicely. I'm just holding the back to tighten her up. And then you can use a little bit of maneuvering here just to make sure that you have the bottom of the tie to the top of your belt. Ta-da! There we go. That seems surprisingly easy. It is.